Welcome to my channel. For my third request today, I have Pink watching fan covers on YouTube. <laughs> this should be interesting. This is Pink watching fans cover her songs. Be interesting to see her reaction to that. Before we get into that, I want to thank you for your support and for your comments and for making requests like this one. I never would have found this, never would have looked for it, never would have thought to watch it, and yet here we are. And I'm really looking forward to it because I think this is really an interesting concept that an artist would record herself watching others covering her songs. <laughs> Just a really unique approach. Before we get into that, I do want to remind you that I put the artist links in the description of my videos so that you can support them. And I also put the link to the request form so you can request music if you want me to react to it. I do not take requests from the comments. So make sure you fill out the form. So, this is Pink watching fans covering her songs. <laughs> now I know how it's supposed to sound. Incredible. Pink is watching us do this. <laughs> I'm freaking out. What? Hey everybody, this is Watching Covers with Pink. What about us? That's better than I will ever sound. The, broken, happy ever after. the us is all of us that feel unwanted and forgotten and invisible. Okay, well that's just rude. <laughs> it was fine. <laughs> Actually, now I know how it's supposed to sound. Is she like a recording artist that makes records and puts records out? I okay, well that needs to change. Okay, absolutely. <laughs> I'm going to cry. Oh, that's so amazing. Thank you so much for watching my video. I love you as a person. I love all of your music. And ah, I'm all speechless about this whole thing. I love it. I feel so honored. When I wrote Perfect, I was pregnant with my first baby, and you get into a very reflective state when you're pregnant. There's a lot of feelings. And that was a song full of feelings. <laughs> get it. She reminds me a little bit of Brandi Carlile, which is another singer-songwriter that's incredible that I love. Aww. Yeah. How old is she, do you know? 11. She's so much better than I was at 17. And she's playing her own guitar, which I love. Aw, that was so good. That's better than I do it. Eva, it sounded amazing. Thank you for sending that to me. Is she watching? Play that guitar, and I love your vibrato. Oh my god! 
That, that just happened. That, that didn't just happen. I, I, don't even know, I don't even know what I'm saying. That is so cool. I love making covers on YouTube, and so for her to actually see that, that's like insane. And it's really inspiring, and she's, I can't, I can't even believe that. It just means so much to me that you just watched it. It was so crazy. Oh my god. <laughs> Well, you can tell they sing a lot together. I used to be in a three-girl group, and I used to spend hours perfecting harmonies. That is what we did, and that's awesome. I actually didn't write that song. I was happy to sing it, but um, it's funny. My mom always picks a favorite song from my album, and it's always maybe the one song I didn't write. <laughs> that was that one. <laughs> Amazing. Again, better than the original. What's next? Oh, all right. Wow. The emotion in her voice is what kills you. I loved that. I loved that. That was intense. There's no box you can put that in. That's what I love about it the most. So exciting not knowing what's coming your way. Oh, who knew? I'm like, what song is this? It's so good. Until we, until we, until we meet again. I love his voice. I wrote Who Knew for a friend of mine that died from a drug overdose. And it's just about, I mean, it, since I've written the song, it's become about all kinds of things. I think that's why I love it so much. Damn. That boy can sing. Well, damn. Okay, I'm never singing that song again. Can I say it was like a better than Ed Sheeran? Who I love Ed Sheeran. That's a very high. Who's that guy? That's Isaac. Who's Isaac? What the hell, Isaac? Thanks for making that song unsingable. That made me want to cry in the middle. You're amazing, and you're, you should shout and sing forever. <laughs> Thank you so much, B. <laughs> my, 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 my heart is just like beating 1,000 times a second. I just don't know. <laughs> it's amazing. Goddamn amazing. If she, if she needs some, some musician for her tour or something, she just got to call. I'll be there. <laughs> Right from the start, you were a thief, you stole my heart. I love to see little kids singing really sad songs about love, like their heart's been broken. Oh my god, I used to walk around the house. The greatest love. Now you went talking. I want to hug him. <laughs> like, whoever she is, let's go beat her up. Things you never said enough of our love. For such a young age, you have incredible voice control. And I'm super into the hair flick. I wrote the song with Jeff Basker and Nate Roos from Fun, and I find it interesting. You can be in the same relationship and the experience that each person is having is just, just completely different. Johnny, you're awesome. I love your hair, and you have incredible voice control. And I want you to be my daughter's boyfriend. <laughs> Hold on. No way! You stole my heart. What? When did this happen? That's like the coolest thing that's ever happened to me. I, it means a lot that you said I have really good like voice control. Coming from you, that means a lot. 
Um, your voice is incredible. I don't know. I don't, I'm just really speechless right now. I don't really know what to say. Honestly. Thank you so much. <laughs> Sober, I wrote at 3 a.m. at a house party. I wanted everyone to leave and go home and just never come back. <laughs> it's one of those nights. <laughs> That's amazing. Tiana, I love your rasp. I'm wondering, did you smoke cigarettes ever or is that natural? Because mine's gone and it's because I quit. I'm very sad, but I love hearing you have it still. She watched our video. <laughs> My God. <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe this. <laughs> I can't believe this. We, we love, love you. you. Ooh. Ha, <laughs> nice. <laughs> I like that the drummer is singing. I play drums, so. It's like if Devo covered your song. <laughs> I love this guy with a cowbell. But you see. Wow, hair metal. I wrote a hair metal song. Hit that note. That's a high note for a boy. I like seeing boys sing girl songs. I could have been a hair metal band or a glam rock band, maybe. <laughs> I mean, that's rad. It's a different take. Oh, that's rad. Yeah. Well, that's a high compliment. Tell him thank you. Or I can. Thank you for saying that. <laughs> You're welcome. You're welcome. <laughs> that was very cool. Very cool. Yeah. 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 So maybe too much cowbell? <laughs> Get this party started on a yes. Saturday night. I've seen this or heard Everybody's this. Everybody's waiting for me to arrive. I've got lots of style. Check my gold diamond ring. Yes, I'm a rock I opera. Wild if you know what I mean. I'm coming up, so you better get this body started. Favorite version ever. It's a very different take. Get the Party Started was, I stalked Linda Perry and she had that song, she had just written it and it changed my life, that song. And I've fully come back to it after what, it came out in 2001 and in 2017, I've finally fallen back in love with it. It's pretty, it's pretty cool. If you love to travel, I think that's one of the more fun things we've ever done on this channel. That was cool. Uh, I especially liked it when when she was calling the people that were that had put up the videos and just blew their mind. Uh, I know that uh, Davina Michelle, we listened to her last night sing that very song. And what about uh, us? And and uh, when Pink called her her career just took off so it was cool to see that that whole interaction and how they did that and uh, i just I, I never would have expected to see a a singing artist a star to call or to, to actually watch well you know I, I mean sometimes i think they maybe they do watch covers but to actually watch them and then call the person 
and tell them how much they appreciate it. That's really impressive. Uh, kudos to Pink for doing that. That was far above and beyond what she had to do. All she had to do was just watch them, but to actually watch them and then call them was very special. And on, you could see how special it was to them. Their minds were absolutely blown. That was cool. Uh, if there's more of this kind of stuff on the internet, I'd like to see it. So please request it if you know about it. I pray for each one of you that God's peace will inhabit your heart and that that peace that passes all understanding will keep your heart and mind in Christ Jesus. And I pray that for every single person that you love. This is the Vietnam Mirror Vet, out. <laughs>